like a hell cut. Before we get started, I have a favor. If you enjoy my content and want to see me continue to improve in both quality and size, please check out my Patreon linked in the description. Any amount helps and it is greatly appreciated. There are so many rewards for each level of donation, so go check it out. Now back to the video. Hey everybody, this is Matthew Bledavenger. Welcome to the most recent pre-release for uh, the Minecraft uh, update, Caves and Cliffs first part. Uh, pre-release one. And in this one, there's a couple of changes, including the re-edition of the, um, the candles, which were removed in the previous update, but I'm not 100% sure if I even uh, reviewed that one, because there's been a couple updates, I think since probably whenever it was announced they would be splitting, maybe the one after. I had had a chance to actually um, record, because I've been busy with work and all, so we're, we're back here, and uh, we're going to go over the couple changes, so... There have been a couple of minor changes as, uh, within the past few weeks since the last time I was here, including just texture changes, which uh, we'll, we'll go and light up everything, so it can be brighter. Um, as you see with these, uh, the texture changes with the candles, is uh, they now actually do look like they're lit up, which is um, actually, no, which is actually quite amazing. Um, they're now more candly candles. Yeah, um, there was something with the Azalea, but I don't actually remember. There's still this issue, and there's still the spectator mode issue. I have complained about it, and I've seen a bunch of people complain about it, um, on the bug report page, and they keep on saying it's resolved, but it's not, so I'm not sure. Uh, but there have been a couple texture changes to these, um, since the last video I did, all minor, but, oh well. And there have been some changes to the signs, they now actually have an outline on them, which is really cool whenever they're made glowing. Uh, I wonder what happens... Oh! Ooh, ooh, actually, that's cool. That was not at all what I was expecting. Um, we can do... Glow... Um, we can make it pink. And make that glow. So yeah, there's the outline, so it will be a lot easier to see, especially, uh, if you happen to be using a wood type that, uh, blends in with the color you're wanting to make it. Overall, I think it's really cool. Uh, but the biggest part of this is we finally have the advancements for this snapshot, at least the one, or for this uh, update, at least the ones that are coming in the first part. So if we go to the advancement page, uh, we have, um, I am confused. Why don't I see all of them? Slash advancement. Slash advancement. Add advancement. Give, grant, everything. All right, maybe this will work now. All right, yes. So there have been a couple of advancements that are given, and I'll, I'll go ahead and show you how to get all of them um, momentarily. So the wax on, wax off one is granted to you. Uh, wax, um, or just just a shape of copper. Yeah, it's gonna be doing this for a moment. I, I might have. Um, I might have made a mistake. I definitely made a mistake. All right. Um, so you get the wax on, wax, you get wax on by doing that. Wax off by doing that. Pretty straightforward. Um, others, uh, you, I actually got this one earlier. Oh my God. That's gonna be going on for a hot minute. I definitely made a mistake here. <sighs> Are you done? Oh my lord. <sighs> Alright, I already got this one while doing the setup. If you make a sign glow, it will do that. Oh my gosh, how many of them are there? Um. I believe for the most part they're all gonna be in husbandry. If I'm not mistaken, no, there is there's a couple here actually. I swear. Yeah, there's a couple here. I I made a mistake. I think that's done though. Alright, so yes. Wax on, wax off, you just 
put wax on copper and take it off. That's how you get wax on wax off. Uh, for the other one, glow, you put it on a, <clears throat> on a sign. Uh, for these ones, tactical fishing, uh, the cutest predator, and healing po uh, power, the healing powers of friendship. Uh, catch a fish without a fishing rod. So, ca actually, that might be one that we already have. Um, I know these two are the new ones. Uh, catch an axolotl in a bucket, which is something you can do. Um, I have no idea if they even spawn naturally at this point. Uh, but so, like, I would, I would go over here and and then bucket. I would, I would. Well. Ah. You know what? Yeah, there we go. Okay, it worked. It has to be a bucket that already has water in it, so. Uh, but yeah, you do that, and then uh, the other one, the other advancement, is uh, the healing powers of friendship. Team with an axolotl to want to fight, so you have an axolotl with you against, like, a drown. Or something like that, and, um, yeah, you get that one. <clears throat> the next one um, in here, there's not a next one in here, give me a second. Um, with exploration, it is surge protector, protect a village from um, undesired, from... Undesired shock without starting a fire. So if I were to uh, slash locate village and then just fly up, yeah, spectator issue still exists, and I have no idea what's causing any of this. Um, what direction did it say it was in? Two forty and negative one forty four. So this way. Okay, here. Uh, but yeah, you would get it essentially by having a lightning rod and just waiting for um Please please go away. Uh just placing it here and essentially just waiting for um lightning hits so a slash summon lightning. And if it doesn't start to fire you, you get it. Um, after that, uh, there is uh, light as a rabbit, so you you'd put on leather boots <laughs> and walk on powdered snow. So put on boots. Show you this. And just walk on powdered snow with boots. Pretty straightforward, honestly. Yeah, that's how that works. Um, and then also in the exploration, there is new ones with the spyglass. Look at a parrot through a spyglass, look at a gas through a spyglass, and look at the inner dragon through a spyglass. So, spyglass. Gas. Um, parrot. These, one, these ones actually won't all be hard. I mean, most of these will just be in your normal, survival, your normal world. If I look at a parrot... I would get it for that. Look at a gas. I would get it for that. So, is it a bird? Is it a balloon? And then slash summon in your dragon. I get it for looking at that. So yeah. Uh, let me check. Make sure I didn't miss any. So yeah, that's basically all that came with the snapshot. With the snapshot, but it is a pre-release. Um, it is basically just saying, hey, yeah. Um, the update's coming out soon, so yeah, 1.17, part 1 of Caves and Cliffs, will be coming out, uh, in June. Uh, a lot of people are actually expecting it to come in, in at l latest late July, but it seems we are going to be getting it in June, which is absolutely incredible. I have absolutely no problems with that, but, yeah. What do you guys think about all this stuff? Uh, I apologize for not being able to post in a little while. I've been busy working, trying to avoid school. So yeah, thank you all for watching. Please like and subscribe for content if I'm a social skier of the channel. Discord, join the cast of Patreon. If you feel like supporting me, this is Meth. The Avenger, have a nice day. Stay safe. And if I missed anything, please let me know in the comment section down below. I am prone to doing that. And as always, thank you all for watching. This is Meth, the Avenger. Have a nice day. Stay safe. Peace out.